right, I guess it works now. That is the last time I'm ever going to be like streaming off of a device I do not trust. But ladies and gentlemen, I just want to sort of start this like sort of stream off because I haven't like slept for fucking 24, 48 hours at this point. Like I've been awake for a little bit. So after this, I'm actually going to try to sleep. I was trying to sleep earlier. But uh, I fucking had to put on a sweatshirt and kind of make this and sort of talk about it real quick. This is going to be long, maybe like 10 minutes at the most. But uh, a night ago, I was actually playing Rainbow Six Siege um, under the weirdest circumstances ever. Um, I got a Discord PM from someone who was going through an incredibly rough point in their life. And they were willing to sort of like end it all and shit. And so far, the situation's been, like, fucking resolved, obviously. Like, it's not a big deal. It's it's over. And I've remained in touch and shit. But, like, I can't really fucking fall asleep, you know, without, like, getting shit off my chest. You know, it's like, everyone involved sort of, like, asked me if it's all good and everything. And I've sort of been, like, holding it out, holding it fine or whatever. And they're all good now, dude. Everything's, like, fucking fine. Like, everything's good and shit. And I played Rainbow Six Siege the entire night. And I had, like, one of the best fucking times probably ever. You know, I I played, you know. It, 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 was, it was okay. Like, all things finally fucking ended well. And Jesus fucking Christ, dude. One of, like, the weirdest things ever. I think out of the entire times that I've been sitting on this entire channel for years, you know, doing videos and shit, that night was probably one of the most heaviest ones that I've had. You know, truth be told. Like, fucking... When you've got like, when you've got like a webcam open and like everything can go wrong ever, could possibly happen is like the fucking wake up call of your life. And I'm just glad everything all ended fine. And I wanted to sort of be at peace with myself because of it. Because for the for lit like literally, I can't sleep thinking about the whole situation. You know, had it went wrong, had had anything had gone wrong, you know, had the worst would have happened. But uh, yeah, you know, and beyond that, when I look at when I look at that one person, you know, I sort of see how big, like, this channel has gotten, and, like, it's it's kind of crazy looking at just a number, right? Because, like, what happened a night ago was, like, such a micro level of this channel that it was, like, one, one person out of about, like, 1.5 fucking million, and it was, it was the craziest shit ever, you know? Like, someone's life was on the fucking line, and all of a sudden, you know, like, just being there got it taken care of, got it sorted out, and everything just ended up being better than, you know, before. Like, it was all fine. I'm still in touch and everything. And something that, something, the worst that could have happened finally ended up going well. Someone going through the absolute worst moment of their life, you know, finally got turned around just by joining in there. And that really is what it is. You know, it was a night that had I, had I actually fallen asleep, you know, without looking at my phone... For 10 fucking minutes, something bad may have happened, you know? Someone could have actually taken their life, okay? Because, like, I wouldn't have fucking been there or something. Like, it's just the weirdest thing that's been fucking with me for, like, the last 24, 48 hours. Like, it's one of, the, it's one of those things, man. And it made me realize just beyond after that situation finally got settled and taken care of how, like, fucking thankful I am of everyone in here. Like, or, or everyone who watches or everyone who's part of this channel since the beginning, dude. Like, I have been, like, flipping through old VODs, you know, of, like, six, seven fucking years ago when I was playing Chrono Trigger to, like, 300 people on Twitch TV and shit. And, like, it's been, like, a reflective time. And I, I have never been more thankful to all of you than I have right now. What happened a night ago was such a micro level that... I, I still can't fucking get past any of it, dude. Like, it was the weirdest shit. It was me. It was my boy Brian. It was my boy Jordan. You, you'll see him as a mod on these streams. It was it, it was just a group of us, and we were there. And, like, it went from something that could have gone so fucking south to something that fucking got taken care of, man. Like, <laughs> holy shit, dude. It was just wild. And I've never been more thankful to any of you all in my life, you know, I know that I say it all the time, I know that I bring that shit out, but, uh, man, it's good, dude, it's fucking good, you know, it made me think about myself for a little second, too, right, like, 
I've been on this platform for so long and, you know, everything that we've had so far, like this whole like grounding rod of an experience has probably almost like, you know, just made me a fucking more happier person because of it. So what happened in this situation, and again, I'm never going to name names over here. That person knows who he is and God, I hope the best for them and I'm their fucking friend forever at this point. But it's just like, after going through all that, and finally fucking being here, it's like, it's also made me thankful, and it's made me thankful for the people that I keep around me, the good friends, and all of you, and it, I think in a way, like, as weird as it is, it's almost like fucking rejuvenated everything, and I don't know, dude, it's been a, it's been a wild, like, 24, 48 hours, like, I can't fucking, I couldn't sleep, and, and maybe after this, I'll go finally to bed and, and have a good night, but Jesus Christ. Shit is wild, man. Shit is wild. <laughs> to think had I not responded to a fucking text message. Ten minutes later and I just slept soundly asleep. God, the worst could have fucking happened. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen. I think the final closing thing that I have out of this is... The best thing that I've ever gotten out of this channel. Ever. Is not just you guys. But like, the best friends that I've ever made. Period. Going forward. I've made... Probably, if I could count, like, 15 proper friends that I've made for my entire life through this whole fucking channel. And it's been, like, the wildest fucking experience going forward. And, like, I don't know how this whole, like, story kind of ends. Because, obviously, everything comes to an end. You know, I'm never going to be fucking making videos forever and shit. But, like, I, it's obviously not going to end for now. Like, it's going to be fucking going on for a while, right? Like, I mean, I'm going to get old at one point. But, like... It's been such a journey that so far, when I'm now that I'm in like 48 hours, I'm taking account into everything that's gone on. It's been like, it's been eye opening, you know, so to speak, right? Like, for the first time, I not only do I feel fucking older, I feel like I've, I've aged at this point. I, I've stopped. I finally began to think about life itself. And I am without a doubt. So grateful to the friends that I made and everyone around. And it's like, finally, after all this, man, I can just, I can go to bed. I can relax. I can have a, I can, I can fucking breathe easy and shit and call it a night, dude. Thanks a lot for everyone showing up. Sorry for like the impromptu stream type, type shit, dude. It's, it's been, it's been a night. Sorry that I can't like get every thought processed out. It's like, it's gotten to a point where <laughs> it's like, it's been a night, man. It's, it's, it's been, it's been a day, it's been a night, but finally, like, it's off my chest, it, it is what it is, good night, I'm gonna fucking head to bed, take care.